blue state refugee. Don't turn red blue. This is Orsi Official, Old Guy at OldGuyTalksToMe.com. Well, it's all about creating a kick ass life for yourself and those that you love. Go check out my podcast and subscribe, share, and review. I'm on the major platforms. Uh, there's lots of stuff to help you create that kick ass life that you want uh, while you still can. <laughs> oh, blue State Refugee. Oh, don't turn red blue. So, we have an interesting phenomenon going on in, in the United States here, in these here United States. You got a bunch of people fleeing the politics, the life in these blue states. California, New York, Illinois, oh, and also like major cities, Chicago, New York City, uh, Los Angeles, San Francisco, all of that. And they're moving to what's called red states. <laughs> and, uh, uh, you know, oh, Georgia, let me forget, Georgia and the Carolinas, yeah, there's also, uh, oh, I'm sorry, that's not, that's where they're moving to. So, and they're moving to all these places, they're moving to Arizona, Nevada, Texas, the Carolinas, Florida, Georgia, uh, Iowa even, yeah, Iowa's actually, uh, it's, it's a great place for people to retire, uh, they just leave during the winter. Um, but what's happening is that the, this whole thing, this whole phenomenon of states going purple, and there's a misconception that, you know, you fled, and this is right, I'm talking to these people that fled these states. You fled the politics, you fled the corruption, you fled the crime, uh, you fled the rioting, you fled the crappy schools, the crime, all of those things, all of those things. The, the, the abhorrent business policies that exist, and you fled all of those things. To go to a red state and what do you do well basically you show up and you shit where you live because you're bringing with you the politics that you fled you fled these places and now you decide to vote for blue politicians for democratic politicians are you insane you know insanity has been described by someone i think some people attribute to albert einstein is doing the same thing over and over and expecting different results. So if you continue to elect these so-called progressive, which uh, I think that's a totally dismal word, uh, progressive politicians, well, guess what? You're going to get the same stuff, and you're going to turn that red state into the shithole that you left. Why would you do that? Because guess what? Once that happens, there's no place to left to go. There won't be any escape. It will all be blue states. The whole United States will look just like Los Angeles, just like the crime-infested areas of New York City and Chicago. Chicago. People being shot all the time and killed on a regular basis. Do you really want that? Well, if you keep on voting blue, that's what you're going to get. Why would you do this insanity? Now you have a little chance here. You know, first of all, you got these elections coming up in Georgia. And then in two years, there's an opportunity to retake the House of Representatives and keep the Senate. But if you continue doing this, if you continue voting blue, well, you're responsible. And it is a self-inflicted wound that you create on yourself. This is Orsi, old guy from www.oldguytalkstome.com. Podcaster, check it out. You'll be glad you did.